So you finally learn how to customize t-shirts and use all of your equipment. Then what? One of the biggest questions that we get from our viewers is how to make local sales or how to advertise. And in today's video, that's exactly what I'm gonna talk about, how you can optimize your business on Google so you have a better chance to make local sales. However, this is very important that you know this. Even experts struggle with SEO because SEO is a very complicated thing. So it is very important that you always try to be on top of the game. Always ask your family, your friends to share the video, comment, so that way you get more priority on Google and gives you a better chance to be on top of Google search. And I'm gonna show you the proper and friendly keywords and also show you some mistakes that the competition makes that you can maybe take that on your advantage so you can get more priority. Because it is very important that you are on top of Google search because Google search is the number one search engine for making local sales and where most people uh, are looking for this type of services or any type of business that you do. It doesn't have to be t-shirts, it could be any business that you do. So it is very important that you are on top of Google search. But before we move on, I wanna thank everyone who joined to our most recent YouTube channel, which is Evaristo Brothers. And I wanna invite you guys, if you haven't done it yet, uh, that channel is gonna be about how you can do this exactly this type of things like online sales, marketing tips, uh, how to monetize your videos, how to make content, tips on making content, and a lot of good stuff. So I invite you guys to check it out, but of course, after we finish here. Uh, and make sure you give us a like, subscribe if you are new, and then go check out our most recent YouTube channel. And if you're into that type of content, I invite you guys to subscribe there too. But of course, it is completely voluntary. So now let's begin with the video. Okay, so let's pretend that we just started a custom t-shirts in our local area. And we're gonna use uh, the city of Indianapolis in the state of Indiana as an example. Uh, let's type in uh, custom shirts. There you go. And the first thing you wanna do to get an idea of what people are looking for anything related to custom shirts. These are the top searches of how people are looking for this type of services. So now it's detecting the city and we're gonna choose this one, okay? Because this one has a geographical uh, keyword and meaning, which is the name of the city. So now let's click in. And by the way, I'm using uh, Microsoft Edge on private mode as you watching i'm just a, as a guest you cannot do this in your regular search because it's going to detect the cookies and your search history and it's going to give you the wrong data so you want to search all of this information in incognito or private search okay so that way you get a more accurate data we see here the terms uh on top there's like google maps and other websites that probably paid a lot of money to be on top of google search we don't see any uh, videos so far just like uh, services from websites now what we're gonna do my friends is we're gonna go on youtube and do uh, look for this same uh, search here okay so now let's go to YouTube and again, I'm using the private mode or incognito and now let's type in custom shirts in Indianapolis. All right, so now let's go down and see, this is one of the biggest mistakes that people make. They usually use keywords that are way too big, have no uh, friendly SEO search. Look at how big this title is. We did not see that video here, even though it was the very first top video that it came across on YouTube. And it has been uploaded over a month and has no views. This same one, no views, but look at the title, okay? 
Look, the problem is that people, they don't have information about keywords and SEO. They use long titles or uh, keywords that are not SEO friendly. Okay. That's what I like to call them SEO friendly. So we don't see any of these videos here on top of Google search. And let's uh, keep in mind that Google and YouTube are the same company. Actually, Google, it's the biggest search engine on um, when it comes to you know looking for services and we don't see none of that here i'm going to show you one of the tools that we use a lot even here on rdi it's an extension it is approved by youtube it is a keyword explorer okay made by tubebuddy this is the company that we um it's an extension where you find the perfect keyword for your videos and again, we're going to talk about a lot of this um, uh, key, uh, TubeBuddy a lot in our new channel, which is Evaristo Brothers. Again, the link on the first comment of this video or on the description so you can see more uh, strategies that we use for keywords so you get more views on your videos. So now let's type in that uh, keyword that we found on Google search on the very top, which is custom shirts in Indianapolis. All right. Now TubeBuddy is going to tell us what's the search and for being a local keyword, this is really good. Okay. It is not perfect, but it is searchable. There's been 15.2 thousand searches, um, in, uh, you know, recently. So this is a really good keyword. Okay. And that's the one that we're going to use. And I like to use these keywords because they're very SEO friendly because it has a geographical um, reference, which is the city that we want to target. So that is how you're going to make sales. If you know what city you want to target, you always look for that. Again, you don't need uh, this uh, extension. You can just go to Google on incognito mode. And just type in on the beginning and it's going to give you the reference on the service. Like, for example, let's do decals, car decals. And this is uh, right away. It will give you how people are uh, recently looking for anything with this uh, term, which is car decals. Those are what's trending right now. That's why it came up first. So those are the keywords that you want to target and always try to use. Or if you want to add car decals for business and then add the uh, city in Indianapolis, see that that's going to make a difference. It's going to be the same keyword. So now I'm going to upload my uh, video for commercial and sales only. And I'm going to show you how I fill out the keywords and all of that. Okay. So after we found the perfect keyword for local sales or for a video for making local sales, uh, I, I just uploaded this very short video, uh, for making sales. And, uh, the very first thing, of course, we're going to do here is type in the keyword and the title for the video that we found with good SEO search for Google. Type in our keyword, which is custom shirts in and then the location. And again, it doesn't cost you a dime. This is completely free. You just need a YouTube account. Never use anything like the name of your company and then shirts and stuff like that, because frankly, I don't want to sound rude. They don't care who you are. They just want to know who's making custom shirts and they're going to go most likely with the person that's on the top. Always try to use those friendly keywords, which is custom shirts, uh, fundraising shirts, uh, special event shirts, whatever. Before we fill the uh, description on the video, we're going to go down to the keywords and click here. Uh, always click on no, it is not suitable for kids because that will avoid you a lot of problems. So, um, let's go down here and first, actually let's, uh, go to where it says video location. And we're also going to make sure that we type in the city that we live in. Okay. So there you go. I choose the state and the city. So that way, uh, YouTube and Google 
which is the same company they recognize where this video was filmed. So now let's go to the tags, okay? Here comes the most important part. Uh, we're gonna type in the same, which is the title of the video, custom shirts in Indianapolis. And then the comma, and it's gonna add the first keyword. Now the second one, let's just do custom shirts. And we're gonna type in tags that are related to the service and in the location okay uh for example we're gonna do customize t-shirts and that's another uh, way people type in on google search uh the services indianapolis stuff like that you know always find whatever it is that you do that's related to t-shirts or custom t-shirts type in the keywords and always type in the location. And that's gonna help you give um, your video more SEO. So now let's uh, focus on the description and we are also gonna use proper hashtags. We're gonna use custom shirts. Try to use uh, not too many, but at least five hashtags. Okay. And then we're gonna go on the description. We make the best and then capitals letters custom shirts in indianapolis and then go back to lowercase if, if you like to know more about our services just leave a message all right so we're gonna go with this this is just an example a description i'm just trying to show you how you're gonna start the description a little you know information about the business maybe what we make the best okay and then in capital letters we're gonna put the same title custom shirts in indianapolis all right and then now we're gonna make this public and save it and we're gonna give it a few hours into google and youtube kind of like you know detect the keyword it give us a better chance to be on top so we're gonna click save and then we're gonna wait a few hours and then look for the video on google and youtube on incognito mode all right so now after a few hours had passed since we uploaded the video uh, we gave it enough time for google to give this keyword a search we're gonna type in custom shirts and then in indianapolis which in this occasion is uh, the local area that we are trying to target. Of course, since this is free uh, SEO optimization, you must keep in mind that there are companies that pay a lot of money to be on top. So I don't think that there'll be a time when uh, anytime soon that we'll get prioritized on Google search way on top but uh, I believe that we, you can get a position as high as here if um, time passes, you get reviews and you share this video with your family, friends, so they can uh, watch the video, they can comment probably, and you know, give likes and all of that. So that way Google detects that and it gives you more priority. If you have a, a, an additional website, It'll be much better if you also share that YouTube video on your website. So that way you get more SEO. So now let's go look for the thumbnail that we uploaded, uh, that we choose for our video. All right. So as you, as you watching, there's no sign of it, but it's been only hours since we uploaded the video. I gave it enough time for Google to give us some type of priority. And there it is, see, not bad, right there. Almost 23 hours. We're gonna go now on YouTube and see what's the SEO there. So now let's uh, type in again, uh, custom shirts in Indianapolis. And there you go. See, we're way on top. And as TubeBuddy, showed us that that's exactly how people are looking for this keyword which is custom shirts it, it, it'll be the same probably with your local area try to use custom shirts then 
your location or the name of your city. And as you watch me fill out the keywords, always uh, type in the state and the city so that way you don't get the wrong city. Maybe you never know. So always try to type in accurate keywords. And that's, that is why we are on top of uh, YouTube search because we used it properly. There you have it. Uh, hopefully you guys uh, can get a good result on this. And again, keep in mind that this is free optimization. You don't have to have even TubeBuddy. Always try to use the proper keywords. Never use your business name because the way people are going to look for your services is not by the name of your business or any of that stuff that many make that mistake. They use their uh, business name and nothing related to that. So always try to use keywords and hashtags that go with the service that you provide, like in this occasion, custom shirts. Well, guys, thank you so much. And again, if you like to join us in our new channel, this will be the type of content that you're gonna see on Everisto Brothers. Again, the link will be below on the first comment or on the description so you can watch the video of what our channel is going to be about so you can get more tips on creating contents or making local sales a lot of stuff are going to be on that channel and if you like this this video here uh, make sure you give us a like subscribe if you're new and yeah we will see you again on the next episode